what's up everyone welcome back to another episode of venom vlog and today we have a toy review we're going to take a look at the epic hero series spider-man there's going to be four figures in this set there's venom there's spider-man there's miles morales spider-man and there's also iron spider-man so yes i did see people saying oh man i hope we get the other symbiotes in this size i wouldn't be surprised if we see carnage at some point in this wave but i doubt we'll see really any of the other symbiotes because this isn't really for collectors this is more for parents who are walking down the aisle with their kids and their kids are screaming and crying and they want to give them a cheap toy. So this is a $10 item. And I don't mean cheap as in like quality. I just mean price wise. Uh, so this is a four inch figure at a $10.99 price point. And you can pick them up, I believe, at Walmart and Target. I found this one at Target. And uh, I'm very excited to get a Venom here with uh, this cool artwork on the side here. And he's got an accessory that goes around his arm. So let's crack this guy open and check him out. All right, so taking him out of the package, we still have this to get him out of, uh, which he is bolted in there pretty good. But then we also have his accessory, which comes wrapped up separately here. So this is like a cool symbiote blade to wrap around his arm. I think they did a good job. That's actually a really nice mold, uh, in my opinion. I think they did a fantastic job on that one. So we'll add that to him here in a second, but let's first get him out of there. All right, so we got him out of that annoying packaging. Let's check out his articulation first. We got a ball joint in the shoulder which is really nice, and a swivel, so that's pretty cool. It doesn't go in every direction, though, because of these tendrils coming out of his shoulders, so they do stop at a certain point. But still, that's good articulation there, I think. And then you got the elbow. Nothing on the wrist, although the arm does swivel at the elbow, too, as well as bend. And that's the same on the foot. There's no ankle joint, but it does swivel at the knee, and it bends at the knee. And then you got, in the waist here, in this area, you got an ability to do side kicks and front kicks. Not so much back kicks, you know, but that's all right. Um, so not a lot of articulation. The head does move. Um, but for, a, you know, a $10 four inch figure, this is pretty good. Actually, I like this. I think that has some good playability there. So kids who are collecting these can get some good movements with them and maybe create some cool action scenes uh, for sure. So let's add this um, add on here, this accessory to Venom's wrist, and it wraps around his hand like so and gives him a cool tendril. Uh, and uh, blade kind of combo there. So the tendrils wrapping around and forming this axe. It kind of looks a little bit like Riot from the movie, but uh, yeah, I don't I don't care. <laughs> it's cool and it makes Venom look even more awesome. And I love the tongue. Man, they went real crazy with the tongue. Um, so be careful with that because I think if you yank that out, it's gone for good unless you glue it back in there. But it doesn't, it, you know, bends around, but it doesn't like move or spin or anything. Um, doesn't have any one of the, you know, that kind of toy feature to it. But overall, this is neat. Actually, I'm really glad I got this. I, I couldn't believe when I saw it in the aisle uh, at Target. I went to get a couple groceries, and when I, I went down to the electronics because I need to get canned air to clean some uh, electronic devices that I have. And then I on my way back, I saw this like hiding in a corner uh, next to some Lego. And I was like, oh, wow, someone like tried to hide it or something. So I was so happy I got him. And then I also picked up the Iron Spider in the series because I have an idea for a video of this, but I might need to go buy two more of these guys before I make that video. So you might not see the video for a while on Iron Spider, but for now I want to at least get this one out of the way and remind you that you can get Iron Spider in the series or Miles Morales or Peter Parker Spider-Man. Those are available too, but I think these are one a box because I saw the other figures in a different aisle and it had all the Miles and all the Peter Parkers and then the Iron Spider, but only saw the one Venom and one iron spider so they may each be one per box so they might be a little hard to look for but again these are more maybe figures for collectors um and then the other two spider-man and miles like i think those are going to be for just you know kids who just need a toy to you know calm down uh so yeah so that's why there's going to be an abundance of those but there's probably going to be lesser of these guys so if you see one pick it up today and let me know what you think down in the comments below of this figure I think he's awesome. I give him probably a four out of five, considering what it is. Obviously, it's not as detailed or, uh, you know, as um, grand and big as some of the other figures I have of Venom. But for the scale, for the price, and for what it does, I got to say this is, I see value in this big time. And uh, hopefully you do too. So if you do or don't, let me know down below. We'll keep talking down there. Thanks so much for watching the show. As always, like, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And we'll see you in the future. Peace.